similar type pattern. Here we are, it's a nice sunrise, not a cloud in the sky from our KRDO studio right now. Get outside, maybe enjoy it. It's frigid, got to bundle up for that morning commute. We do warm up nicely, that's the key. That lack of cloud cover allows that uh, radiation from the sun, I'm not gonna get too much detail, to warm us up here at the surface. We continue this warming trend through the day on Thursday. By Thursday, we're very mild, warmest day of the week potentially, but we will watch for high winds as well as the potential for some fire weather. This weekend looks gorgeous, dry, not a cloud in the sky, and even the winds cooperate. So there is light at the end of the tunnel if you're not a fan of this taste of winter. Currently 10 degrees in the spring, 7 in Pueblo, so single digits decorating portions of the high country uh, down towards Pueblo. Then we get teens when you get out towards the plains. Not much of a wind chill, but you do need to bundle up as you wait for that bus, for your morning commute. And then we warm up nicely, like we keep mentioning, few clouds allow seasonal temps to return. 49 degrees by the early afternoon hours. 52 is what we're expecting here in the springs as the high. Then you jump down towards Pueblo, 59 degrees, 54 Canyon City. Yesterday, we were 20 degrees below average. Today, we're about 3 to 5 degrees, if not at that average. And that plenty uh, of sunshine will make it feel very comfortable today. 50s, uh, even some low 60s can't be rolled out, out towards the plains, just depends how quick we do warm up. Any evening plans, I would keep in mind, it gets breezy as we get towards the afternoon and evening, so there will be a wind chill effect again as you do uh, really see that sun begin to set. What we deal with between 1 and 7 p.m. today, another day, fire weather is on the table, mainly out towards the plains. Rapid fire growth aided by 35 mile per hour wind gusts will be expected, so just use some extra caution for any potential fire starting activities for today. So we're breezy at times and sunshine makes a return out your door this morning. Southerly flow to start the day, so we will warm up nicely as we get towards the afternoon. Few filter clouds overnight and out our door for the day tomorrow, but we do expect to be at that seasonal feel, maybe a degree or two above average for Wednesday. As far as our highs, that brings us to 59 in the springs for tomorrow, 64 in Pueblo, mid to upper 60s out towards the plains, southern I-25 as well. It'll feel real nice starting tomorrow before those winds really begin to pick up. This is what we are alluding to by Thursday. It's the fringe right now. The potential is there for a high wind day, but I can guarantee you fire weather will be expected for the day on Thursday. That's our next high impact weather day. Enjoy the day today. Enjoy tomorrow. Winds ramp up for Thursday and then looking ahead a bit. By the time we get to Thursday night into Friday, another system moves through. Right now, I'd expect it to favor the Palmer Divide, Teller County strictly. Very limited moisture. It's going to be hard to get much accumulation here in the springs. What I can guarantee you, temps drop 10 to 15 degrees really for everyone. So it will be cooler Friday, but that's just a little sample because by the weekend, beautiful 60s, 70s will make a return, guys. Plenty of sunshine, dry conditions. This is the first weekend I'm excited for because the weather has really cooperated. Take that gladly and look forward to it.